This weekend, you can see the cutting edge art brought to Baltimore Museum of Art by actor and filmmaker John Waters. And Paul Gessler had the chance to speak with Waters today about his donation. The BMA's newest collection. The extraordinary, maybe even wacky. Opening this weekend. It's like crazy. But beautiful and interesting. Is a lot of things. Peculiar, for sure. Crazy in a great way. To a lot of people. Unexpected, surprising, uh, winking. Collection mirrors friendship. The John Waters collection is, of course, all those things. I would always just say delightful for all the wrong reasons. The Baltimore artist walks us through the collection. She was Cookie's girlfriend for a long time. He recently bequeathed his art to the museum, all 372 pieces and counting. But it's really lovely to be able to see them now and especially to see them with him, you know, to be able to walk through. And this one I'm more in the middle. The museum refers to the exhibition as a cutting edge articulation of American individualism, particularly as it relates to queer identity and freedom of expression. But all of John has been a go to for me as a young queer. Water says the museum sparked his creation. Creativity when he was young. And I hope that I can do the same thing for the next weird little kid that wants to take a picture that nobody likes. 90 works will be on display, all representing a slice of Waters' personality. They represent a type of contemporary art that the BMA actually just doesn't really have. So he's really bringing us into a new type of contemporary art. The John Waters Collection opens Sunday and runs through mid April. Reporting from the Baltimore Museum of Art, I'm Paul Gessler for WJZ.